What's going on, YouTube? I'm back here again in the greenhouse, looking at the hot tub aquaponic garden. I guess it's been a little while since I showed this guy off. What, last time I did, we had, or we got, some fishes. I still see one right there in the center. One right down here, just hanging out on that seat, I guess. Uh, just threw some water, or food in that. Yeah, just threw some water in there. That way, maybe they'll come to the surface. Uh, just threw some food in there, hoping maybe they would come to the surface, but... You can see the food. All I see, you see those little black dots everywhere. Um, <laughs> Malabar seeds that, well, I was throwing from that bed over there, and I guess they didn't make it into the bed till I was throwing them. But I threw some of them over here. There's uh, one right there, one right here, one right there. But uh, got, still have some little tiny lettuces. Guess they're showing off some true leaves there. Some extra pipes just sitting around from where I was. Uh, clean out the pump the last time, but I haven't seen any floaters in here yet, so that's a good thing so far. Um, let's see, not much has uh, been changing there, there's a nice little lettuce, another one right over there, um, another one right here at the base of this rosemary, I'm not sure if they get along with rosemary, but they're going to have to, uh, but the rosemary all looking pretty decent, look at that, all sticking up nice and tall, you are new. That is all clones that I put in here. I just cut them off of the master plant, just stuck them right into the aquaponic bed, and next thing you know, they rooted. Um, yeah, there's another little lettuce right over here. Oh, I'm touching rosemary. Now my hand's going to smell like rosemary all day, um, which is always a good thing. What happened over here with this little mound? Looks like I was messing around, but I didn't. I did right there. Pak choy is all gone. Pulled all that stuff out of here. These, uh, rosemary, look at that, They're nice and tall, all looking pretty decent, uh, dead dragonfly back there, I don't know what's up with that, but dragonflies love to die in these beds, um, over here, these rosemary, not really looking so good, you can see over here, maybe it went dormant or something like that, I don't know, but, uh, looks like it just stopped growing and browned out a little bit, so maybe that was from all the cold that we had, I don't know. I'm not an expert on growing rosemary. I just thought I haven't, so why not try? Um, still that one guy way over there in the bench seat. I don't see anybody. Uh, there's one hanging by the pump. I don't see any more. I don't know. There should be 15 in there. We'll <laughs> find that out shortly. Holy heck. A pile of seeds all over the floor. Um, in here, tons of lettuces all popping up. Look at that. Nice guy right there. Uh, disturbed a few of them because I was cleaning out the bed. Uh, most of all that Malabar, that old Malabar that was in here, I yanked all that stuff out. Look, another dead dragonfly right here. What the heck? And look at all these seeds everywhere. So as I was clearing this out, like I was saying, uh, I was grabbing as many seeds as I could, throwing them into the lava rock aquaponic garden over there, uh, most of these beds and everything. So hopefully, if uh, it works out right, I think I'm going to have at least a couple Malabar in every single bed. Uh, yeah, except for the deep water culture bed. Unless they made it all the way over there. I don't think they did, though. But yeah, that's just about it. Oh, wait, here's more lettuces right here. But uh, yeah, I got a pile of lettuces. Um, let's see. Well, might as well come back around here. And I've got my little air pump here. Funny thing, you can hear that. Well, first off, it's at a goofy 90 degree angle, so it's not supposed to be like that. But you can see how it got all dark and everything. Well, that's from the heat buildup, I guess. And uh, the whole bottom side of this, you can hear that, it has a big old hole. Actually, if you pick it up, see that big old hole in there? But uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to cut that back. But the whole thing seems to be pretty brittle. So I'm not sure how good I'm going to be able to do that. But uh, pump's still running good. I still have my little overflow here. Huh. Just noticed, yeah, I got my little overflow here, but I have nothing coming out of the filter. <laughs> so the filter's not working. All right, I'm going to have to go ahead and shut that valve. And then uh, I guess the water will be making it into the filter there. And yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, no, I don't know what the heck I was thinking. I was thinking I had to turn that one off. No, I need to turn that one off so it stops just flowing out and goes to the filter. But anyway, uh, one other thing, you can see remnants of an indigo rose right there. So hopefully we'll have some of those growing as well. 
But I guess only time will tell. We gotta wait for uh, the weather to warm up a little bit. It's, uh, I don't know what it is today, like 50, something like that. So, not too bad, but uh, still cold. All right, well, that was it. Just a little walk around here with my little uh, grasshopper dude. The only grasshopper I allow in the garden. Um, and his legs are in the water. I don't know why. I need to move them. Let me see that right now. Well, he's wedged between the bed. Move that guy back here. Look, he's doing a face plant. Eh, close enough. Anyway, that was my little walk around here. Figured I'd do an update. It's been a little while since I did an update on this garden. So, um, yeah, I'll come back with that lava rock aquaponic garden, uh, garden in the back there. And we'll have an update on that. I do have some footage of the fish. Uh, the only catfish. The only one I know about anyway. So we'll go ahead and show those off uh, next update whenever I show that thing off. So thanks for hanging out with me. And uh, as always... Uh, hop down in that comment section, do the comment thing, um, uh, throw a comment down below, not just for me, I love all the comments, but for everybody else, I encourage everybody to hop it down into the comments section, find someone new, subscribe up to them, watch all their videos and everything, and I'm sure they make much better videos than I do. Um, also, uh, if you want to go check out my Patreon, it's up there, uh, patreon.com slash TV. I also have the Instagram.com slash TV and the Twitter.com slash TV. if you want to get in touch with me somehow. Um, I guess that would be how, right? Hmm, weird. Um, but anyway, um, yeah, mystery Amazon links down below. Don't forget about the live streams. Ooh, uh, hopefully this will come out tonight. Because uh, tomorrow, guess who's coming back on the live stream? You'll be, you want to check that on out and uh, see what we get up to with that. Batman's coming over as well, coming on. And uh, yeah, it'll be a good time. That's uh, usually Mondays, uh, Wednesdays, and sometimes Fridays. So check that on out. Um, yeah, do all that fun, happy social media stuff down below. I will catch y'all in the next video. Till then. Later.